So tough decisions. Do you make them? Do you like them? I don't. And here's one of the things that I've realized that even tough decisions, right decisions, hurt. They're difficult. They're painful sometimes. And even though we may know it's the right decision that we need to make, it may cost us. And we have to understand that part of decision making is paying the cost of the decision. Today we had to put down our Jack Russell Abbey. It was a tough decision, one that I did not want to make and one that I did not look forward to. But do you know what? If I loved her as I said I loved her, then I needed to do some things for her. And it was hard. It was hard being in that office and holding her and going through everything till her breath was gone. But you see, one of the things that God asks us to do is make tough decisions. When Joshua said, choose today whom you will serve, it's a hard decision sometimes. Jesus said, if you're going to follow after him, you may have to lose your family, your brothers, your sisters, your parents. It's tough decisions that he's called us to. And sometimes we don't want to make them because they are so tough. They are hard. They are difficult. And yet, and yet we need to. I realize that in making decisions, there's a lot of, well, there's a lot of thought that goes into them. I don't think you should enter into any hard decision lightly. But still, we have to deal with the outcome of those decisions, don't we? We have to deal with the fallout of what that decision is going to create. Even when it's the right one to do. And sometimes people don't want to make the decision. They don't want it because they don't want to hurt others. They don't want anger. They don't want disappointment in other people and yet and yet if we don't make those decisions sometimes we create more suffering we create more hardship we create more difficulty I think in following after God what he says to follow after him and don't look back put your hand to the plow look forward you have to do so with your eyes open with the understanding of the cost and so my challenge today is to think about the things in life that you, well, that maybe you've been putting off because they're tough decisions and you don't want to deal with the consequences of them. I'm going to encourage you to think about that today and think about, Lord, what is it that you want me to do? Ask that in a simple prayer and then wait for him to give you direction. Remember, every decision has a cost, even the wrong ones. Think about it, would you? Until next time, God bless.